a game dev secret about tiles. Take a look at the ground that Athena is running on right now. It looks like one continuous surface, but it's actually made up of a bunch of individual tiles that are 32 by 32 pixels. We created a couple different versions of the tiles that make up the ground, and then we vary them randomly to create the actual terrain. When you hear the word tile sets from game dev, it's referring to this collection of individual tiles. But there's an obvious problem with using a tile set like this, which is that it's incredibly tedious and time consuming to hand paint every single tile in the game. The solution to fixing this is called auto tiling. Auto tiling is when you create a set of rules that the tiles must follow, essentially telling every tile on the tile map where it would be legal to use it and how it has to behave. Now that's a little confusing, so what do these rules look like? The tile sets are basically chessboards that depict every individual tile in the game. In here, you can create rules and apply them to all the tiles you want. Just pick a tile or two and add a physics layer. This is now applied to every tile you place from here. You can also define the y-axis of each tile so the floor remains under other objects, like trees, 